Hello, Jane Cleland here. Can you give some examples of a telling detail? Yes. A telling detail is especially important in short fiction, short stories, flash fiction, where you don't have the room, the scope, to go into lengthy descriptions. A telling detail is a world in a word or a sentence or two. A telling detail sums up an experience or reveals character, informs some aspect of the story that you need to make sense of it, but you just don't have the room to go into a long explanation. So here are two examples. A woman is sitting at a bar having a martini and a man comes in and sits next to her and notice, notices that there's a tan line where a wedding band would normally be worn. Now, we don't know what that means. Maybe she just kind of came from a massage and you take off all your jewelry for a massage and she's meeting her husband at the bar in 10 minutes. Maybe she's uh, recently divorced. Maybe she is uh, interested in some companionship, not her husband. Never know, but that's an example of a telling detail that gets the reader curious. Here's another one. A man is in his hotel room, looks out the window, sees the pale winter sun on a pasture, and the cows just standing there. We know the season. We know it's daylight. And we know that we're in a rural area where there are cows in a pasture, all because he went and looked out the window and saw the cows under a certain light. Telling details, distill it down. And my best advice on how to do that is to ask yourself, what am I trying to express? What am I trying to communicate? And then distill it down and synthesize it. I know you can do it. Best of luck. And uh, I hope you find great strength and solace from reading and writing.